and this time we are gonna give this swing and swinging effect using CSS so let us see how we can do this in CSS so for that first of all let me open my figma okay so this is my figma and uh, here you can see I have already grouped the elements that I want to animate like uh, this tiny leaves and this uh, swing so let us uh, export this and then we are gonna animate this so to export click on export button then select SVG okay uh, first of all select the whole tree then click on select SVG click on this three dots include ID attribute because if you will be not including ID attribute you can't identify your image specifically in your uh, in your basically uh, CSS while animating it so to identify every element specifically include id attribute and then click on export okay uh, select only the image that you want to export click on export as i have already exported this image so i will be not clicking on save but you have to do it so let me now open my visual studio code so after opening my visual studio code let me open the image that i have just exported this is the image and let me create my index.html file first so i have created my index.html file now give here svg animation after doing that create one div with class um, image and then select this whole svg path and paste it over here after doing this uh, save your index.html file and let's uh, link our index.html file with our css file so it's like style.css yeah so we are done with our html dot uh, uh, dot html file and now we will be moving on css file but before giving any style to our html file let us see our html file with the help of live server so this is my html file for now so let's give some styling to it first of all remove all the margins and paddings given by browser so margin is equals to zero padding is equals to zero and then give it a body color so let me select this color only uh, which this rectangle has so that my image looks thin over here so it will be like background color and then give this color wow now select the image class and uh, give here some position like uh, absolute then top 50 percent and uh, left 50% so let us see our okay so it is far away from left margin so to make it uh, exactly in center let us give this translate trans translate and then it should be minus 50 okay uh, it will be transform translate so let us give this a transform of translate minus 50 percent and minus 50 percent so now our image is in center so our styling is done and let's code for animation now first of all select uh, the swing that you want to animate so i will be selecting this swing with the help of the id we gave to it and 
for giving styles to id we will be writing hashtag symbol now after doing this let us create our animation that we want to implement on our swing so to do that first of all let us say add the red keyframes and give this a name of swing then zero percent and it will be a transform of uh, rotate z rotate z of angle suppose minus 10 degree so let's select this uh, copy this all and paste it over here 50 percent and another would be 100 percent and this should be plus 10 degree so after creating your animation you need to give this animation to your components so now i will be giving the animation to my component with the help of animation style and here i will be writing first of all my name of the animation then speed of my animation then it should be working for infinite time and in a linear motion so let's see okay so you can see that it's right now not swinging it's just moving the whole swing up and down in the crossword direction so to make it swing first of all give this a transform origin of uh, top and now let us see this okay it's better but not exactly the way we want our swing to swing give a swing motion so to do that first of all create a transform box to be fill box okay now we are getting a swing motion for our swing so after giving this motion you can manage its speed and everything with the help of uh, animation tag only you can also increase the speed if you want like this i guess this 3 was perfect or uh, 2.5 let us keep this 2.5 yeah so guys now let's animate a tiny leaf using another keyframe so first of all let us create our keyframes and this time i will be giving this a name of wavy and then it will be from zero percent to fifty percent okay um to fifty percent and then to hundred percent and let me give this some effect like uh, transform uh, let us use this time skew x like uh, 5 degree minus 5 degree to plus 5 degree and then again minus 5 degree Or let us keep this zero degree so now let's see how uh, we can give animation to our tiny leaves so i have group all the tiny leaves which were on ground to under one group which is group one so i will be selecting this uh, group one and uh, we will be giving this group one the animation effect uh, vv vv for speed two seconds and it should be for infinite time infinite okay uh infinite time and let us keep this in ease in out so let's see how this effect to our uh, animation a uh, tree so you can see that it is not waving because it is not stuck to the ground it is just moving forward and backward so to make it wave let us uh, say that transform origin must 
the bottom and now we would be seeing an wavy effect so uh, that's it for today guys if you like this video please share it with your friends and stay tuned with this channel by subscribing code our creatives thank you guys and have a nice day